Yo, what up guys, welcome back to Let's Play Pokemon Wide in the last episode. We ventured to Route 77. Oh, the music changed. No. Okay. I'll talk for reals. We just went on to Route 7 and uh, we got some stuff done here. Fought some peeps. You know, the good stuff. We're on our way to Celestial Tower. Oh, by the way, thanks to your gracious comments on one of the last episodes. That's not what I wanted to do. I did indeed nickname Tynamo, and the nickname that I saw the most was indeed Hydrus, in reference to the Shadow of the Colossus. Colossus, the little fishy guy, he's got the electric things on his back, so he's kind of like an electric fish slash eel. So yes, I agree that does portray Tynamo best at this stage in the game. Um, okay, got the item. I found a pee, -pee up. Ooh, good. Now my PP won't have trouble getting up. Yes! Anyway, uh, so we're back here on Route 7, and I did fight an Audino I saw off-screen on my way back to name the guys. So as you can see, Noki is very, very close to leveling up, and also it started raining, so that's lovely. Not gonna chance it against a Zip Streak, though I'll die, so let's just fight this uh, Ranger instead. I'll show you our style. My Pokemon and nature are in harmony, baby. Don't I know it. I believe you. Look at that. Ranger Mary has three Pokemon. They're not going to make level 36 easy. Look at this. <clears throat> Swadloons? See, it's at stages like this that I wish I had Ice Punch or Mega Horn. <clears throat> nudge, nudge. That's okay. We should be able to kill these guys with Scald. is powerful enough. Might get a ban. Maybe a ban? No, not a ban. Bug bite. Get your shit together, man. Oh yeah, plus Scald is powered up because of the rain. Yeah, these guys are toast. Perfect time to start raining. And that should get Noki to 36. Alright, cool. Noki's done. Ooh, Encore. Fuck no. Can I get an Encore? Do you want more? Brooklyn Brawl with the Brooklyn Brawl. So for one last time, I need y'all to roll. I tried so hard. It got sure far. Where's Hydrus? Sent his ass into the front. Uh, what else did I do off episode? Oh yeah, I nicknamed uh, DK Jr. I re-nicknamed him because pretty soon he's going to change into DK Sr. And I don't want to have to go back and change his nickname because none of my Pokemon can learn Fly still. So I had to catch one of these little guys you see on screen right now, Tranquil, here on this route. Teach him Fly, fly back to Castelia and nickname Hydrus here. So while I was doing that, I was like, ah, I'm here, he's going to evolve into levels. I might as well just nickname him now. So I did that. So uh, you guys will see his nickname in a minute. And you know what? Actually, you can already see it on the side of the screen there. So yeah, it's Viacong. I was going to change it to a much more clever name, Darmonicong, because his evolved form is called Darmonaton, so Darmonicong. I thought it was clever, but it didn't fit by one letter. And I was not willing to sacrifice any other letters in order to make it work. So instead, I decided to go with Viacong. Why you Kong? Oh, crit for the loss. Good thing there's a healing house here. So yeah, there he is, Fire Kong. And although he's got the severe weakness right now, against my better judgment, I'm gonna send him in purely for the fact that he needs the levels, yo. Because he is gonna evolve here. I'm just, you know what? Fire Blitz. It's weakened by the rain. It's not very effective. This guy has skull. He's probably gonna burn me and have my attack. Or just straight up kill me. Okay, why would I even try? I'm sorry, I thought I could outspeed a semi-poor. Call me crazy. Ugh. Alright, what I should have done from the start. Hiya! Why is this semi-poor so fast? Damn, yo. It shouldn't be faster than... Oh, no. How did he avoid it? I'm dead. This dude's gonna fucking steamroll my entire team. Holy shit! This semi-poor, what is going on here? Alright, if you outspeed Avion, we're gonna have problems. There's no reason you should outspeed Avion. Thank you. Holy shit, man. What the hell is going on with this semi-poor here? Totally threw a wrench in my con- Look at this, my whole team. Somebody beat us here, dude. It's all gone. Great, now Noki has to get the experience out of everybody. Lovely, that's what I wanted to see. 
Fucking hell, dude. I'll tell you, you know my team has problems, dude. Serious weakness to water. But that's why we have uh, Mr. Hydrus. Shit, dude. Way to obliterate. Oh, hey, yeah, yeah. Look at this. I totally forgot about that. Noki's evolving. Oh, do I? Okay. Forward the text. I'm just afraid to press any buttons. I don't want to stop the evolution here. Evolution. Wake up the sleepy samurai. Oh my god. And this is, yeah, this is definitely the most drastic change. He goes from Noki, the little cute two handed guy, to this motherfucker. Look at this beast. Look at that dude. Totally not even. Goes from bipedal to quadruped. Now he's like some super monstrous thing. This guy actually does stand up on two feet. What they don't show here is he can, uh, he has like this sword that he wields, but they don't show it here. There's no way to really. <clears throat> Slash, huh? Oh. oh, wait, wait, no, 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 don't give up on Slash. I wanna, I wanted to look at Slash, I didn't want to go back. Yeah, so Slash is physical. Oh, Lord. Yeah, let's give up on Water Pass. We don't need it. I believe Arnoki's a physical attacker, at least I think he is. Last time I checked. Oh, what is their style? An ass pear berry. Yay, now I can put pears on my ass. Okay. Um, man, my team took a beat in there. I just, now I'm curious. I gotta look at Noki here. Uh, oh, you know what? He's kind of both. Oh, yeah, yeah, he is a special attacker first and foremost, though. But due to his nature, I think he, oh, yeah, he is a special attacker. I should have kept water pulse. But then again, we need more diverse attacks, even though normal type attacks are absolute shit, so. Whatever, okay, let's go heal. Uh, healing house is over here. Yeah. So this part of the route past the house here, we're not going to go there, because that leads to Twist Mountain. So we're not even going to fight the people here. We'll fight them later. Don't worry about it. Don't even worry about it. Don't get it twisted. Because we just need to go to Celestial Tower, which is right past that other ranger up there. It's, you know, it's probably been on screen. But I'm going to put it off once again, because we have other things to do. Oh, I see that grass shaking. Gr yeah, I gotta go for it. But first, I gotta put somebody worth a damn in front. Well, not worth a damn, but Noki doesn't need the experience. Who's bugged? Adino, baby, yes. Uh, the other Pokemon you can find in shaking grass here, I know, Un Pheasant and uh, a Mole Guy. Oh God, Rain! I forgot about that. That's gonna be a problem. I'm just gonna go for Fire Punch. I don't even want to hurt myself with Flare Blitz. It's not even worth it. Why you call him? Yeah, it's worth it to not hurt myself. Cause what is this thing gonna do? It can't do anything to me. Oh no, not Hustle. Now I'm a healer. Um, oh, it can use Attract, and it will use that. I better hurry up and kill it before that happens. Secret power, really? What is that bug? Our right, Fire Punch. One more. Oh my god, it's not doing shit. Hey, look at that. Oh my god. Did your secret power just put me to sleep? Oh, dude, well, facade doesn't work when I'm asleep, does it? Okay, wake me up. Looks like pin missile. Wake me up. Oh, lord. Oh, now you use a track, you whore. I wonder if a track counts as a status, so facade does more damage. Please break through it, Fire Kong. Yeah, yeah. See ya, bitch. Critical hit. And that's gonna be 34. Yes. One more level, mother truckers. Plus zero to that special attack. That 19 special attack, dude. Ah, uh, yeah, now I'm never gonna get out of this grass without a million battles. Oh, it's a Zebstrika. Zebstrika. He makes a farting noise as he appears. Well, there's only one thing to do when that happens. Run! He's crop dusting! Oh, no. Yeah, let's kill some more of my Pokemon for fun, why don't we? Bunch of assholes. Fucking stupid-ass, fast-ass Substrika. No, fuck no. Alright, let's see you do damage to this guy. Let's see you do damage to this guy. Or better yet, let's run, because I know Avion's faster than your stupid ass. 
My god, the encounter rate in this game! It's a dingle butt. Oh, hey, look, we get to see Noki in battle. Oh, epic Noki. Yeah. Why did I have to go in this stupid stuff? He does look pretty cool. He doesn't look as cool as when he was, like, a little tiny, tiny cool dude, but, you know, he's still cool. Alright, so we need to go to the, uh, house with the peeps here. And we need to talk to the movie learner chick, finally. Oh, yes. So, now that Noki has evolved, he can relearn a move, because at level 1, Samurott apparently learns Megahorn, but you can't get a Samurott at level 1, that's impossible. So the only way to give him this move is, you got it, the mover learner. So we're going to teach Noki Megahorn. And of course we're going to put it over the shitty ass slash that we just learned. Forget slash. Megahorn is a really good move. It's basically one of the most powerful bug type moves. And uh, it covers Noki's grass weakness really good. So now his only two weakness is electric and grass. Electric is covered with dig and grass is covered with Megahorn. Alright, and all it cost us is one heart scale, so that's all the business we ever have to do with the mover learner. So that's good. And now I'm gonna go heal. And I think I'm gonna keep Fire Kong in front just in kill Fire Kong until he gets one more level and evolves. And then it'll be Hydras in front. All day er day. All day er day er day on Puzzle Lin. Yes, we hope to see you again. Yeah, that's real nice. Real nice lady. Um, dowsing machine. Alright, we're not taking no more grass. We're doing this. We're getting to the place. To the Tower of Spiral. Or is it? No, it's Celestial Tower. Sorry, uh, forgot I said anything about Spiral moves. Okay, is Fire Kong in front? I'm saying it all normally. Fire Kong? Uh, booyah, fight me. There we go. Alright, Ranger, don't decimate my team like the last one did. There's the tower right up there, by the way. You saw a sign for it. Look at this guy, Pokemon Ranger Pedro. Whoop for Pedro! Hey yo! Hey yo, G -da -da -do 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 -do. Come on and slam. If you wanna fight Solosis, come on and jam. And welcome to your band, man. I'll just use facade. It's not even worth using the weakened fire moves. Look at that, dude. Beast attack stat for the whistle. Solosis is a bit. Ooh, an Axu. An Axu Ranger. Oh my god, dude. Okay, guys, I'm back. We beat that guy. I didn't grow to level 35. So that's unfortunate. But there is an item this guy is trying to hide. What is it? A Max Ether. Yeah. Oh my mama. Is there hidden stuff here? for sure, right? Okay, anyway, look, we finally made it to Celestial Tower. This place is basically like the Lavender Tower. Rest innocent spirits. Yeah, it's where the dead things go. I think there's a... I don't know. There was an item back here of hidden sorts. Maybe, maybe not. Alright, let's go inside. I recommend having a Pokemon with fly before you go in here, so you can just fly from the top of the tower instead of having to go through like all the encounters and stuff. But, I don't have that, so I'm not following my own advice. Do as I say, not as I do. Pokemon are laid to rest. Yes, what are these? Gravestones of death of doom. Uh, this place is really cool with the perspective, too. I like this thing. And the music. I love the music in here. It reminds me of Chrono Trigger. So hard, Chrono Trigger. Like Guardia Forest or something. Alright, are there random battles up here? I don't know. Um, but there are a lot of trainer battles, so... Be wary of that. Let's uh, just do what we can. Bunch of weirdos in here who, f who like, who fights in a graveyard? That's like you're going to a graveyard for your own reasons. Nobody even knows. They don't even ask. And then somebody's like, hey, you want a fist fight? You know, just is like, nobody does that. That's not okay. That's not acceptable. That is not normal. I should report you to the police. Energy. All right. Uh, fire punch. Don't really feel like hurting myself right now with Flare Blitz, so... By a paunch will do the job. So close to 35. Is that going to get me there? Is it going to get me? Oh, so close. Yeah, okay. I was going to say, please tell me you have another Pokemon. Solosus! Colossus! Dude, Solosus is so like Colossus. If I had a Solosus, I would name him Colossus. <laughs> that would be so tight, because you only change one letter. And it's Colossus. Look at that. DK heals himself. But, oop, 35. 35. 
You know what that means. Oh, he wants to learn taunt. Should I move be replaced with taunt? Hell no. Fuck taunt. Yeah, give up on taunt. There we go. And sigil if Ooh, this is prime time for Hydrus. Time to prove yourself, Hydrus. H Y D R O U S is here. He's finally here. Using uh, spark. Okay, that's all I got. I ruined the syllables already. Please don't kill me, Sigilyph. I hate you. I fucking hate you. Why does everybody get a critical on Hydrus all day, dude? Damn. The one guy I care about if you critical. God, you stupid asshole. Man, I hate this guy. Dude. Take some rocks on your head, you fucking Cyclops piece of shit. Look at you, you're like a freaking rainbow. Pick a color and stick to it, dude. Damn. See if you like acrobatics. I don't even care. Oh, uh, air cutter on a flying type Pokemon. Yeah, well, guess what? Yeah, you like that? Now die and burn in hell. And why don't you take up one of these graves while you're already here? Dickhead. God, I hate Sigilip. So much. You don't even understand. Fire Kong is evolving. I can't even be happy about this because, God, that's the second time Hydrus has died to stupid, unnecessary critical. Mm. Mm. Okay, well, at least we got another badass Kong. We got another badass Pokemon. That's right. Another fully evolved Pokemon joins the team. Fire Kong evolved into Dumbonaton. Yeah, his eye looks all glitched out there, but I don't think it is. Hammer Arm. Well, let's see what Hammer Arm does. This isn't going to be a final move, but I'll check it out. Oh, yeah, physical 100 power fighting type. Oh, yeah. We'll definitely learn that. Oh, no, 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 don't give up on Hammer Arm. Yes, forget. Let's forget for now. Uh, let's forget Facade. I mean, 100 power off our awesome physical attack? That's really good. So, you know... And it's fighting type, that's gonna give us good coverage against normal types. For now. Alright, I'm gonna go heal because stupid Hydras died. Um, I guess this is gonna be the end of the episode, right? Like 20 minutes. So I'll see you guys next time where we continue up Celestial Tower. Peace out.